the hay, which we have the double helix, kind of like the DNA strand. Can you all see that? Hay is the sound of life and spirit and is connected with the word, which indicates an unlimited and undefined number. Hay, which is the two of them. It means millions of years or infinity when it is applied to time. The netter called hay, mentioned by Bode, personifies the atmosphere between earth and heaven and is identical with the netter shu. Hehu and his counterpart, Hehut, personifies the masculine and feminine elements of iron. So what we're talking about is the primordials, the energies. Hehu is shown standing in the water and mud, surrounded by the element of fire in the darkness. He holds in one hand the scepter, waz, which means prosperity, and the other he holds the ankh of life. The triangular skirt he wears is drawn in the proportion of B, representing the universal order brought into creation by Hehu and other primordials. The order brought out of chaos, he signifies the significance of cycles of time. 